What's up you guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's Tamara here. I'm coming back at you with another video. I'm trying to be consistent this year. Um, so I hope that you guys can see the change and the difference. Um, today's look, I was going for something a little bit more different, something kind of editorial. But it's out there for me. I want to try something different. Um, so if you guys are interested to see how I got this look, just keep on watching. Starting off with my eyebrows already done. I'm just gonna do a little bit more skin prep. First, start with these crusty lips. <laughs> so I got the um, the Pro Crystal Lip Scrub from Fenty Beauty. I really like it. Um, it's very it's got the granules in it, and you can really feel it. I'm gonna use that. So I have a little concealer left over on the back of my hand from where I um, did my brows, conceal my brows. So I'm just gonna put that on my eyelids. So now that that is wiped off, I'm just gonna spray some of this. And wipe it off. And now I also have the Pro Kisser Lip Balm from Fenty Beauty too. Love this as well, it smells so good. All right, and I also got this really cute mirror from Fenty Beauty too. How cute is that? It's like a standing mirror, it has like a little thing right here so you can stand up in front of you. So that's what I'm using today. More skin prep, I'm pretty much already moisturized, um, but I am gonna put some on some eye cream. I got the Ole Henriksen Banana Bright Eye Cream. Uh, just started using this, love this stuff. I'm gonna put a little bit of this um, Bobbi Brown in her face base. In my opinion, you can never be too moisturized. Just for some glow underneath my foundation, I'm gonna use some of this drug cream from MAC in gold light and just put it on the high point. Primer, I'm gonna use my Milk Makeup Hydro Grip Primer. While I'm waiting for that to sink into my skin, I'm going to be using my Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Foundation, Soft Matte Foundation. In the shade 370, couple pumps of that. And then, per usual, I'm going to use some of my um, MAC essential oils, just a couple drops of that in the foundation because I have dry skin and this foundation is super matte. All right, now I'm gonna spray my sponge, some facial mist, and then I'm just gonna go over that. Make sure there aren't any streaks. I'm gonna try something that I saw Jackie Ayana do in her latest video. Instead of using a um, the applicator to apply concealer, I'm gonna try using a smaller brush. That way you could be a little bit more precise, precise with it. I'm just using this little flat brush right here. And I'm sure that it'll work. If Jackie says it'll work. As I let that sit, I am going to prepare the contour. I'm using this um, foundation stick from black opal it's in the shade hazelnut uh, it has a little bit more of a warmer tone to it so I use this a little bit of that on the back of my hand to warm it up and then I use um, a matchstick from Fenty Beauty and truffle and mix that in with it it's a little bit more cooler I'm gonna use this brush to apply the product but I am gonna spray the brush first
Now I'm gonna go ahead and blend out the concealer. Now to blend out the um, contour, I'm gonna take this stippling brush, spray it. I think that's looking pretty good so far. Um, I got this hour um, powder from Hourglass, the their translucent setting powder, the veil powder. I got it in like a mini size just so I could try it and see if I like it. And for everywhere else, I'm going to use my MAC Mineralize Skin Finish in Medium Deep. For bronzer, I'm going to use my um, Fenty Beauty Sunstalker Bronzer in um, I think it's Caramel Cutie. Yeah. Um, because Caramel Cutie um, does have a little bit of a cooler tone to it. So I'm going to use a uh, Beige and Gal. Use that to kind of uh, tone the cool tone down because this one's a bit warmer. So I'm just going to use a little bit of this. And then I'm going to go back in with Caramel Cutie to uh, do a little bit of contouring on the nose. Alright, so now that I've got all my powders in place, I'm going to go ahead and spray my face with my Morphe Continuous Setting Mist. Now that that's dried down for blush, I'm going to use this e.l.f. palette. Pretend like you didn't see that. I'm going to use this e.l.f. palette. Um, I usually like to use uh, these two colors here. Also gonna mix some of my Fenty Beauty Kilowatt Duo in Ginger Binge and Moscow Mule because this one has um, a little bit of a shimmer to it, and I take the um, Ginger Binge side. So I'm gonna spray my face one more time before I do my highlight, and then we can move on to the eyes. I'm gonna be using this um, Extra Dimension Skin Finish from Mac. Got like a nice bronzy color. It might fall out of the pan, so I don't want to tilt it too far. To use my kilowatt duo in afternoon snack and mo honey, I'm gonna use a mo honey on top of that one. I might try something. New and I really hope that it doesn't backfire on me. I have my Fenty Beauty Stunner Lip Paint and Uncensored, which is the red one. I'm gonna try to use this as an eyeliner today and do like a red winged liner. And then I'm gonna use one of these um, detail brushes from Morphe. It's the M217. And it looks like this. So I'm just gonna um, let that sit before I do another coat and move on to the other eye. Guess this brush is what I've been missing all along for 
Liner. I'm gonna try this, I hope it works. Now what I do have is, it's really dirty, sorry. I have this Invisimat powder from uh, Fenty Beauty. I'm gonna try to see if I can set it with that just so it doesn't move around. I'm just using this angle brush from Morphe. This is the uh, E11. I'm trying not to use too much because I don't want to alter the color. I'm just gonna stamp it. Put a little bit of um, black eyeliner in my waterline. Use some brow gel, and this is the 24 hour brow setter from uh, Benefit. Mascara, I'm gonna be using the um, Kush Mascara from Milk Makeup. Again, you need to go buy a big size of this because I love it. So before I do my lips, what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna go um, put on my actual clothes, <laughs> accessories and everything, and spruce myself up and I'll be right back. All right guys, I'm back and I'm dressed. Accessories on, everything real simple. Look at this cute little makeup bag from Fenty Beauty. Um, my lipstick that I'm gonna use is in here. I believe, yes it is. I'm gonna be using the um, Pout Sickle from Fenty Beauty in Hot Blooded. trying the whole editorial look. I don't know what this is, but it's what I had in my brain. All right, guys, so uh, this is the finished look. Um, I hope that you enjoyed it. I just do neutral looks. Well, if you follow me on Instagram, you know that, which if you're not doing, you should go ahead and do because you get a look, you get a taste of everything. You get to see how I wear my makeup, how I, um, style my clothes and everything so if you're not following me on instagram you should definitely um go ahead and go over there and do that my handle is um at tamara faith that's t-a-m-a-r-a-f-a-i-t-h um but again thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you in the next one